going. Ooh. I'm sure there's an easier way to do this. Ooh. But I want to get in front of those, those sneaky lambs over there. And I want to push them down that way. Hey, Zayden. Okay, darling, I'll grab them in a second. Oh, lupins are looking lovely, though. How fat they are. No wonder the lambs are in here. In a second. So I pulled up one of our lupin plants. Look at the roots. And if you see all those nodules on there, um, they put nitrogen into the soil. So these are really good for fertilising um, your paddocks for when your next crop goes in. And then these are our pods. And this is what I... Let's see if I can get it. Oh. Okay, I thought I'd just show you what it looks like inside. I need two hands though. Uh, crack it open. Aha! Look at that. Beautiful. Lupins inside. Full pod. Okay, so we're going to go and slowly work our way down to where the lambs are and hoping that maybe we could see where they're getting out of the fence so we can fix it. So here we go. Let's go watch these little buggers. Okay, they've been gum as usual. Um, so it looks like I'm going to just have to walk slowly pushing them over towards the gate um, and hopefully they go through somewhere and I can work it out or at least get them close enough to the gate so I can quickly open the gate and push them through because there's all the lambs right next to the gate and so I can't leave it open or they'll all be in here okay let's see how we go come on get back in your paddock Come on. Oh, come on. Oh. Mommy, I see. Oh. <laughs> come on. Oh, there they go. Let's go see where they go. Yeah, they're supposed to be in that paddock next door. I've just discovered this. There's a whole lot more right down here where they are joining up so now i'm not sure how am i going to do this i've got to go and open the gate which is down in the corner got to open that to let these guys through without letting all these guys in here so oh well we'll go down and check see how we go someone's getting a piggyback ride since the grass it's so long. Mommy, I can be down here. <laughs> My face is gonna fall off. No, no, I got him. Right, I got him. Now, oh, how are these lammies getting out? Can we tell? Hey. Okay, puffed. I got the gate open. Now let's just see if I can get them through. Look at that, too much of a disaster. All these guys are heading away, thank goodness, from the gate. Oh, there we go. Yay. Yay, 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 yay. Still don't know where they're getting out, though. But who knows? Yeah, I'm so happy I did it. Um, it was a bit easier than I thought it was going to be, so I'm glad about that. A bit smoother. I was worried about everything of running into this paddock. Being lambs, very, very unpredictable. So now I'm going to go grab the buggy and um, I'll drive up this fence line um, and just check everything. 
but I'm not really sure if we're going to find out where they're getting out. And sometimes you never do with lambs, they're just sneaky that way. So, grab this gate and shut it. Just a good old cocky gate. See if I can do this one handed. Probably not. Uh, nope. Okay, just push it on like that. And now we just want to get to the wire untangled. And stick it over the end. Okay, let's fix that in a second. All fixed. Cocky gate. But, you know, they could actually be getting out of this gate here. Wouldn't surprise me at all. And where's little man? Oh, way over there. I left him on the stump because he was not enjoying being piggybacked and I needed to run. had to stop for a second because I ran over a rock in the long grass that I couldn't see to check that I hadn't broken the side by side. Now I think I followed a sheep trail all the way up the fence but I'm not really sure and I couldn't see any obvious signs on the other side where they're getting over so still a mystery to me. I'm still not sure. There is a fence post leaning over up here though so we're going to go home, grab a star picket and fix that up and then I'll check on them later during the day to see if any have got out again. 